Okay. Could you tell us your name, your age, and which country you represent? Uh, my name is uh, Fi Rakotomaru. Uh, I'm uh, 18 and uh, I'm from Madagascar. Where were you born and where do you live right now? Uh, I was born in uh, Madagascar in a small city near uh, the capital called uh, Antirabe. And uh, actually uh, I live in uh, France since 2013. In, you are studying in France, yeah, right? Yeah, I study uh, IUT uh, in France. Uh, I finished my uh, high school year, and uh, so the next school year I will be uh, in university in uh, Paris. So I will study uh, math, uh, physics, and uh, informatics. Yeah. yeah, just in case you guys thought that chess has no connection with mathematics. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> who, who taught you chess, and at what age did you learn the rules? Uh, my father taught me chess uh, since uh, I think 12 years ago, uh, so I was like uh, 6 years old and uh, my father plays since a long time, he, he's a coach now uh, and uh, he really taught me many things about chess, like rules, many uh, s strategical things, yeah. Uh, and what are your plans? Now you are studying in, uh, in France, but do you want to become a full-time uh, professional or you want to have a different job? Uh, I think it will depend on my uh, level uh, for the next years, uh, I mean for the next few years. If I can reach, uh, if I can improve my chess, maybe I will become a, a professional chess player. But, uh, okay, I will see, but I really like chess and uh, I don't want to stop my uh, study uh, as well. Yeah. So basically you can prove, you can be an example that chess can be a full-time profession in your country or in, or in Africa? Uh, I think it's possible because, uh, okay, if I, uh, if I was in Madagascar, if I lived there, maybe it would be very difficult to improve uh, my chess because we don't have coach there. Uh, it's very hard for uh, tournaments to play uh, tournaments. Uh, so uh, I have a chance to live in France and to play uh, many tournaments in Europe, uh, to have many coaches. Uh, so uh, I think I, I would have more chances uh, to improve my chess. Yeah. So yeah, it could be a profession, yeah, I think. So, how did you prepare for this event, in particularly? Uh, okay, uh, particularly, uh, I didn't. Okay, I prepared this event uh, seriously, but uh, I, as I said, I had my final exam as well uh, before, just before this uh, this event. So I had to focus on my studies, but uh, I prepared this event since uh, a long time because uh, I knew uh, since. April, I think that uh, I will play this uh, this uh, kind of grand chess tour. Yeah, so uh, I prepared since uh, April about uh, by uh, like uh, my preparation every day, like uh, my uh, training every day. Uh, so uh, that, that was my preparation. But if my information is correct, I think you you don't have so much experience in rapid, rapid and blitz games, right? Yeah, my uh, <laughs> blitz and rapid uh, ratings are very... Uh, uh it's a big <laughs> gap between your classical rating and your rapid and yeah, blitz, yeah? because uh, I think I didn't play... Uh, I play maybe less uh, blitz and rapid tournaments. Uh, yeah, so I don't have many experiences, but I try to play uh, on internet, uh, bleeds, more bleeds tournaments, yeah, more bleeds games. But uh, okay, I will try to play well this uh, for this event. I will try to focus well and yeah, to play well. So then you think you will perform better in bleeds than in rapid? Uh, it depends. Uh, I think it depends on the, my opponent, but I, I like more uh, rapid, yeah. I like more rapid, I have more time to think, uh, but okay, I'm not, I think I'm not that, that bad in bleed as well. <laughs> <laughs> so that, this brings me to the next question, that whom do you think will finish on the top three places? Uh, in this event, uh, yeah, it's hard, um, I think uh, 
for the top three places, maybe uh, I mean Bassem uh, for the first place, uh, for the second place, uh, I think mm, maybe. I don't know well about the players, I don't know well uh, particularly about the players, but um, if I knew them about the ratings, maybe um, Adush, Adush Mohamed would be the second place, and the third place maybe um, it will depend uh, on many things, maybe uh, I don't know well. Maybe Fee? <laughs> maybe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe yourself? <I> so. <laughs> yeah. So, what does it mean to you to participate in, in this tournament, in, in a Grand Chess Tour format kind of event? Oh, it's a really, uh, it's a big honor because uh, I, I follow the Grand Chess Tour, the real Grand Chess Tour uh, every time. Uh, I, f I really like and I, I've already been, uh, I've already seen uh, in Paris, the real the Grand Chess Tour. Uh, uh, oh, you mean you visited, played, yes? You, mean, uh, you visited as well the, yeah, the I tournament. Yeah, well, yeah. And I played uh, some simultaneous game against uh, with Leso, yeah. yeah, there. So I, I really like the atmosphere of the tournament. So it's a big honor to participate. Uh, yeah, like their uh, top players, like like the top players uh, in the world. And so I'm looking forward to playing it. I'm really excited about it. What was the result in the semi against Wesley? Uh, I lost. Oh. <laughs> I think I lost, but it was an interesting game. Yeah, against Wesley. So yeah, he played against me f4 in the first move. Yeah. Yeah, out of book. Yeah, immediately. Yeah, out of book. Yeah. <laughs> and you are the number one in Madagascar in your country. Is that yes. a blessing, or maybe it's actually bringing? Ex Additional pressure on your shoulders. How how do you feel about it? Uh, I think I've been the number one since uh, 2015, uh, 2014. Yeah. So uh, uh, I think um, it brings me. Yeah, sometimes it brings me pressure when I play a tournament there. Uh, to be uh, yeah the number one and to play uh, on the first table. But uh, okay, I think I used to uh, uh, now, so it's okay, yes. Yeah. So then, how important are tournaments like this one where you are participating for African chess? Mm, for African chess, uh, I think it's very important because uh, uh, it's it's better to know that. Uh, uh, African uh, African chess uh, African chess can be uh, can be very uh, very important uh, and like uh, European uh, or uh, yeah European chess or uh, American chess that yeah, so uh, I think it's very important to that they organize this uh, event and uh, I really uh, I wish that this event will uh, 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 this event will uh, uh, motivate the players yeah, in the region. Motivate yes? the players, and mm -hmm. uh, this event will be back again uh, next time. Yeah. Well, I wish you already in advance best of luck and bon chance. Thank you so much. In two quick questions, uh, Caruana or Carlson? Uh, I was always for Carlson, and uh, I think I'm still for Carlson this year. And short, uh, Dvorkovic or uh, Macropolis? Mm, uh, I don't know well about these guys, but uh, okay, I, uh, uh, I knew that. Uh, I just knew a few times ago that Krakowicz is a very serious candidate, so I think he he will win. The, he will be the he the president. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay, we will see what will happen, and you will be playing in Batumi also, no? Yes. The, I, in the Olympiad, yeah. so we will see in live from there. But first, good luck in the tournament. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much.